Hey, thanks for joining me today. We are filming at the lovely Commencement Condominiums on Ruston Way in beautiful Tacoma, Washington. Recently, I've been fielding a lot of questions from clients who are purchasing for the first time and also some folks who haven't purchased in a couple of decades, but they'd really like to know why the loan process is so complicated. So I want to talk about that. First, let's pull out your notebook and we're going to make a list of all the items that you're going to need for your lender. To start off with, you're going to want your W-2s, at least two years worth, two months of bank statements, any savings accounts that you might have, IRA, any type of statements of any money you have anywhere, you're going to need to have that for your lender. The part that most people get a little frazzled about is they submit a good amount of paperwork up front, but then about a week later, the lender comes back and says, well, I need these things. So for clarification, I wanna discuss the process a little bit more in depth of what happens once you submit that paperwork. Your lender is then gonna turn it over to their processor, who's going to make sure that the checklist for the type of loan that you're applying for is complete. Then your underwriter is going to review all of this paperwork and see if we might need to dig a little deeper into some of that information. For example, let's say mm, three months ago, your brother paid you back the $10,000 loan that he needed to get his Harley, and all of a sudden you have this abnormal deposit in your bank account. The underwriter is going to want a paper trail as to where that money came from. And also if you're switching money online from account to account, they're also going to know why that has taken place. What they're trying to make sure is that you have a consistent stream of income and that they know that you are going to be able to pay for the property. As a buyer, just know a lot is going to be asked of you. It's going to feel like you're jumping through hoops. You're going to feel like they're going to ask to draw your blood next but these things are necessary to get you approved. The process is strenuous, but being prepared in advance and getting your mind prepared for it will make it all that much easier. It might seem like a lot of work up front and during the process when you have so many things on your plate, but in like two weeks after you get your keys, it's gonna be a far figment of your imagination and you're just gonna be happy and it won't even matter anymore because you got what you came for.